UNH football took on James Madison University today here in Durham and walked away with a win of 35 to 24. The Wildcats dominated the beginning of the game, going into the second half with 21 points already. We saw an explosive defense from the Cats all throughout the game, creating four picks, two of which were returned for touchdowns by safety Rick Ellison and Evan Horn. Let's take a look to see how the Cats are feeling after today's game. You know, it's a, it's a very good win, obviously, against a really good football team. It's something that uh, you've seen now for a couple of weeks in our program. Guys starting to play the way they're capable of playing. Played pretty much error free football. Played great defense in spurts. Scored twice on defense. Thought we played downhill on them the whole way. Thought the guy next to me did a really good job of, of, of taking care of the ball today. Made a couple good throws and then a hell of a run late in the game. Just asked him to make some plays, just to keep the chains moving on target, and we did it. You know, hell of a win for this football program, hell of a win for us. You know, it was just something we needed and we got. Had a good beat on, like, game plan-wise. I mean, the whole, we had, uh, knew what we were doing the whole time. We were filling our gaps, and, you know, we got a lead, which was nice. So they had, we knew they had to throw the, throw the ball to beat us. So it's one thing that we emphasize all week and every week is getting a good start. And this week was, like, the first time, maybe three or four games, we, we didn't, didn't score on the first drive. So that was huge for us. You know, when the defense is playing that well, you know, when they're putting up points, it, you know, it kind of drives you, motivates you as an offense to get going. And, um, you know, we had a lot of guys, a lot of different guys make plays today on the offensive side of the ball. You know, we asked a lot of guys to show up today and make some plays, and they did. Right after Rick got his pick, I said to him, I said, listen, they keep running this five and out. And right before that, a couple plays before, he got like a, a PBU on the sideline. I said to him, I said, Rick, if they get another one, I'm going to get it. <laughs> so I just, uh, I saw him five and out and just, just jumped in and uh, threw all my marbles and got it. Definitely a great challenge, uh, but personally, I look at them as another team. We don't care what your rank is. You got to step on the field and play with us. It starts with our preparation this week. Uh, I don't, you guys didn't see it, but we had picks all week, <laughs> so that led to today's game. So we we ball we practiced hard all week and did everything we were supposed to do, and it led out uh, and it showed up today on Saturday. The Wildcats are home again next Saturday, November 10th, for a 1 p.m. kickoff against U Albany for Senior Day and UNH salutes. For UNH Wildcat Productions, I'm Natalie Nori.